Back then, the Sahara wasn't sand. It was green, dotted with lakes, grasslands and rain. Elephants wandered, crops grew, and above it all, humans watched the sky with meaning. Here, black African communities built the world's oldest known astronomical observatory, a stone calendar aligned with the summer solstice and the rising of Orion's belt. Flat stones placed in concentric circles, upright slabs that marked the seasons, a sacred geometry not etched in books, but in time itself. Napta Playa predates Stonehenge by over 2,000 years, and it's more accurate. The Green Sahara. When Africa was Eden between 10,000 and 3,500 BCE, the Sahara was not a wasteland. It was a land of lakes and rivers, cattle herders and astronomers. This wasn't just survival, it was ritual life. Evidence from Napta Playa shows ceremonial burials of cattle, stone circles with cosmic alignment, social organization and spiritual hierarchy. Early observations of star cycles, especially Orion and Sirius, these weren't just farmers, they were philosopher priests. 